Hey, welcome back, guys, to the final episode of the Big Build Off for the 2020 edition. I'm your host, Adam, from Lazy Guy DIY and the Builder's Challenge. And we're so excited you all followed along with us, but we're even more excited because we get to announce who the winner is of this amazing table build. So without further ado, take it away, Clint. Hey, everybody. Clint Harp here. I'm going to take the mask off for just a couple minutes uh, to announce the winner of the big build off presented by the builders challenge. Sorry, Clint, we, we've got to talk about something else first and then we'll let you pick your winner. Uh, I know this is freaking our contestants out because they really want to find out who won. But first, we're going to talk about something you, the watcher, the people that have been following along can do also for your community. This is the culmination of this entire big build off event because we want to be able to have a huge impact on the people all around us all over the country. And this is with Cat Footwear, Build for Better, and the Builder's Challenge. But we want you to build a little library or a community library. We're gonna have full details on this here, and we're gonna have plans, links to free plans down here. So check the website for all the details. But what we're gonna do is, for everyone that's built up into a certain point, Cat Footwear and the Builder's Challenge is gonna donate $25 to Habitat for Humanity. And if you don't think you can build, if you're not as handy with the tools, then what you can do is donate to a community library or a community pantry in your neighborhood. And we'll give you details how to submit that and we'll donate $5 to Habitat for Humanity. So we're very excited about this. It's a great way to give back. If you're a little nervous about it, you can always ask for help around, but this is a great way that we can impact everybody around us. So for full details, I'm gonna put the website up here again. Check it, we're gonna be doing this here throughout the month. But let's find out who the winner is. Take it away, Clint. And all of them, amazing. Seriously, incredible work. I had to stare at these pictures long and hard. I mean, I was zooming in. I was looking at the different details. They were all amazing. I had to narrow it down to two and then go from there. And just that process alone took me forever. But I narrowed it down to Casey and Amy. And... Uh, it was tough, y'all. I'm not kidding. I like seriously lost sleep. Um, this was a tough one. In the end, though, absolute beautiful work by everybody. The winner, though, Amy at her tool belt. Incredible job. What an amazing table. Uh, I am a sucker for contrast. So the walnut with the maple highlights, whoo, loved it. Just beautiful. Uh, beautiful. That's a new word. Beautiful. Um, the 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 detail on the tabletop fantastic i loved how you laminated the stock together on the base and then cut out those beautiful curves which made up the four legs that were all joined together perfectly and kind of reminded me of sort of a cathedral-esque detail which i also love cathedrals um the runner-up um uh, casey his work also had this beautiful curved detail on the base very amazing, just an almost an architectural detail. I loved it, uh, just fantastic. But at the end of the day, Amy at her tool belt, incredible job, congratulations, you win. Thank you everybody for all of your entries to the final four, well done to the champion, congratulations. Thank you so much at the Builders Challenge for making me a part. And uh, until next time, I'm honored to be here. Thank you guys. See ya. Congratulations, Amy. That is amazing. Your table was absolutely beautiful. I know that the other ones were awesome as well. I know when I was looking at them that it was gonna be a tough choice. So thank you to Clint Harp for deciding for us and being our judge. Uh, I know it could not have been easy. So congratulations, Amy. We're very excited for you. Uh, we're excited for the families and charities that receive the donations of these builds as well. So thank you to our contestants and also thank you to our sponsors. That was Moss Epoxies, Rockler, Firm Grip Gloves, Power Pro, Bessie, and of course, Cat Footwear. So thanks guys, I hope you enjoyed this. We'd love to hear what you thought of the series down in the comments. If you think we should do it again, what we should change. But uh, thank you guys for following along and let's look for a big build off 2021. Thanks guys.